Okay, Brianna says she wants to make sure that her engagement is legit. Oh. Brianna, what's going on? Me and my fiance just recently got engaged. Congratulations. Thank Good. you. <laughs> and I'm here to see if he's legit about it because oh. yeah. uh, we broke up for a while. Yeah. And I made a phone call to him because we were on a little break. Yeah. And when I called him, another girl answered. Oh. oh. Yeah, that's not good. Okay. And then what does he say about this other girl? Uh, he was in the shower. Oh. So, so I didn't even get to talk to him. Okay. But now you're back together, apparently, because he asked you to marry him. Yes. And you said yes. Are you guys living together now? We are. Okay. So you are together, mm -hmm. but you still have suspicions? Uh, I do. Is he taking any more showers? <laughs> yeah. He takes them every day. Oh, good thing, good thing, okay. But the thing that worries me is he didn't have a phone for a while. Yes. Because he lost it when we actually went to the rock quarry and someone threw it in a puddle. Oh. So uh, yeah, he didn't have a phone. Okay. Yeah. But our agreement when we got back together was no more Snapchat, no more Instagram. Oh. Because of the fact all the girls I saw on his Snapchat that was Snapchatting him constantly, Facebook messaging him constantly. My agreement was, if I am to get back together with you, you will not have a Snapchat. I will not have a Snapchat. I will not have an Instagram. You will not have an Instagram. In other words, right. None of this social media stuff where you can Only cheat. Facebook because of our family who lives out of state. Yeah. Okay. And I just bought him a phone three days ago. Yes. And let me guess. He's Snapchat. Uh-huh. He added Snapchat. That Snapchatting hoe. <laughs> No, I don't know. So anyway, so, so he's done that. Well, that violates what you, the agreement. So you say, what is this? I Why is this girl's name? I haven't confronted him about it yet. Oh, you haven't? Mm-mm. Oh, so he's, uh, does he know this is why he's here? No. No, okay. Now, when did he ask you to get married? Uh, he asked me about five months ago. Oh, when is the marriage supposed to take place? We want to get married next fall. Oh, okay. Yeah. And now you're suddenly saying, oh, my gosh, he, he could be back to his cheating ways if he's Snapchatting, after he said that he wouldn't. The reason why I think he's cheating on yes. me, because when I went through his phone to get his mom's phone number, I saw this girl, Alicia's name, all through his Snapchat history. Oh. And do you know this Alicia? Nope. Oh. But I can tell because there's little boxes that says if it was a video or a picture, and there was both every other one. I wonder what his answer is going to be. Anyway, here he is. Here's Justin. Hi. Hi. I brought you here today to see if you were for real about our engagement. I am for real about our engagement. Then why do you add Snapchat again on your phone? Because on my other phone, I didn't have enough memory, so I deleted it. <laughs> so, really? Yes. Really? Yes. What about our agreement when I told you the only reason we will get back together is if we got rid of Snapchat and got rid of Instagram? Well, I have friends that don't have, you know, their phone turned on, so I have to use Snapchat to contact them. That's why they got Facebook? Some of them don't have Facebook. They just got Snapchat and they don't have kicks, so I usually hit them up on Snapchat. <laughs> All right. My point He's is. hanging in there. He's why there. are you using Snapchat? Why? Because Snapchat's the thing. Snapchat's the new thing. Okay, it may be the new thing, but obviously I should be the new thing because you wanted me, right? Everyone has Snapchat. I don't have Snapchat no more. I can't get Snapchat on this. I need an update. <laughs> She's saying that this, what is her name, Alicia? Yeah, Alicia. Something's yeah. going on here because you saw a whole bunch of. Uh... I saw multiple, multiple things in one day. Yeah. One day, Jerry. And all these videos. And well, what is she sending you a video about uh, world peace? Was <laughs> she sending you a video of a cat? 
And stuff like that, pretty much. Well, it, oh, it could have been a pussy cat. Let's see. Uh, no, I mean a little kitten. I mean a kitten. Those little kittens, they're adorable. They can get feisty. Let's though. find out what she has to say here. Here's Alicia. Yeah. Okay, first off, do you do you have a cat? Uh, I have a puss cat. <laughs> what? What the f are you talking about? How you? Guess what? Wednesday of last week, I went up to his work to get tacos. He so happened to be in the drive-through, and I went around. He threw me some extra tacos. He went on break, so I waited for him, and we hooked up in my car. And guess what? I that like it was never. <laughs> What do you mean? What? Yeah. Are you are you me? What is it about Wednesday? <laughs> Everything happens on Wednesday. Here. What about that? She's saying you guys hooked up. Yeah. Yes. But yes, you asked I want to be open and honest. I'm, you know, I'm honest about this relationship right now. And I really want this engagement to work out, but I'm being honest. Yeah, I did hook up with her last Wednesday. For what? I got That's amazing. You got bored. Yeah, I you you put, you've been bored. you've been treating me like a child. You act like a child. You're well, going to get treated like one. You're 19, I'm 21. Well, you're not treating me like a child then I why are you with me still rage. then? If you're not treating me like a child. <laughs> Maybe because you had a little bit of maturity that I appreciated from you and how romantic you are. Only one of the pluses that you have right now is that you're romantic. Well, you broke up with me before, so, you know, I thought you'd not break up with me again. That's why I did what I did. How, how was I going to break up with you? We live together. We've been planning a future together. We're trying to plan for a wedding right now. Are you serious? We're trying to plan to get married, to have a future together, to move forward in life. And you're going to go and sleep with a hoe? Yeah. Yeah. A friend? A what? Friend with benefits? Yeah. Really? You think that's funny? That's why you got a smirk on your face right now, right? No. I'm trying to be dead serious with I'm trying to be dead serious. I am serious about her engagement. But like, she, I still... she's not going to want to marry you if you're still sleeping with other women. Nope. I mean, I'm not taking sides here. I'm just saying, obviously, why would she... You know, you seem like a nice guy, but if you're still wanting to date around or sleep around, why is she going to suddenly say, okay, let's get married? Especially all the sacrifices I've been making for you lately. I made sacrifices too to get our apartment. I gave, gave up one up of my. Snapchat. I gave up Snapchat. For a second. <laughs> for a second, I gave up our my Xbox that I spent five hundred dollars oh. on, it. so we could get our apartment. Because we're money now short we're on our talking apartment. commitment. Now. I gave up my hobby, my man time. I'm sorry, so I made fun. I had no idea he gave up the uh, Xbox. <laughs> But what was my promise to you? As soon as I had enough money from working at the bar, I was going to buy you a new one, correct? Yeah. Correct. But I haven't got one yet. <laughs> I also have bills that I have to help you out with. You don't pay every single bill by yourself. Pretty much so. Really? Yes. You pay the rent. I pay the DTE bill, the water bill. I pay, the I pay water for bill. all the gas. I drive your butt back and forth to work every freaking day. Do I not? Yeah. Then what am I doing not to show you that I care for you? I gave up time with my family just to be with your family, to meet your family. I gave up my family dinners to where I only see my family once a year to go and meet your family. How is that not good enough for you? It is good enough for me. But sometimes you just treat me like a child, and I, I know I'm whipped. I'm going to be honest. I am whipped. <laughs> but the thing is with it, you overdo it when your friends come over. You overplay, you act like a different person when you have your friends over. Most of our fights come from is when your friends are over. 
Also, you if want... you didn't drink, that wouldn't be a problem. Then don't bring alcoholics over to our apartment that want to drink with me. Maybe that's the question you need to think to yourself. The thing you need to think of is you're 19. You should not be drinking. If the police were to show up at t our house, I'm sorry, who's going to get charged for serving a minor? You. Then why are you buying me the booze then? I'm not buying you the booze every single time. I buy myself booze. I have friends that are 23 who are your friends as well. Come over and drink beer. They're the ones providing you with the beer. But what was our agreement? You asked me if you can drink. If you want to get laid. All right, we're getting off point here. Do you want to be with her? No. You, you want... I'm still going to keep Snapchatting him regardless. I don't care about their relationship. Never have, never will. He He's won't cute. have a Snapchat soon. We're cute together. Shut up. I'm not talking to you. Really? 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 Dude? If you think that was wild and crazy, then click here to keep watching. And don't forget to subscribe. All you have to do is click here. And one more thing, take care of yourself and each other.